Hello, Magic, and today we're going to be teeing off in Antenna. So, in the last episode, we had the whole Super Rico and Dream World shit ass route. Really weird. But anyway, that's nothing too crazy. And Gitsokyo Lounge, in Gitsokyo terms, anyway. So, we're going to be doing Tenchi and Shimamaru and Arrogance from Heaven. Alright, a person from Heavens and Clouds. Alright, let's go with whatever this is. I can't remember. A person from Heavens, Heaven and Clouds. Who's this? A training monk at the temple. The yokai monk who's friend with a Mundo. A Mundo? Oh, that cloud bag. Cloud bag? Oh, cloud bug. And heaven, Nudos are like useless bugs. You! I've seen you somewhere. Hmm? Have we met? I've seen you fighting with Lady Hedri. You're the Celestial. Of course, you guys are no match for a noble like me. But both Lady Hedri and Lady Miko said that you are dealing with a Celestial. What? A real Celestial is thoughtful and tactical in battle. Oh, -ho! well said for a fool groveling on the ground. Alright, let me show you a Celestial's battle. Shit. Alright. Come on, I do it. I, I don't know if I mentioned it, but I like the idea of Tenchi on the, her keystone. It's just such a fun concept. She's like, she's just too lazy to fly like everyone else is. She's using the keystone to just chill. Like a rare celestial. Fuck though, I didn't really, I'm not gonna lie. For flying on a rock, she's fucking fast. She really is fast. Like, even, I would say even comparable to Marissa, really. Alright, what's going on? Oh shit. That works too. Hmm, of course I'll win against a new doll and a Kappa. We've got it pretty good! No doubt we're the strongest duo now. <laughs> if you trace back the origins of Inchlings, they are a noble and intellectual species. I'm happy I met a partner worthy of me. Wow, Tenshi and Shimonaru are really blowing it up. I did not realize that. Say, you learned a lot of stuff when you can actually understand what the fuck is going on. Who's this? I don't really know about Mass Yokai, but it's a type of Sukumogami. A Sukumogami, another lowly thing. Who's this? She has a less though. She was recently confined and expelled from heaven for a stupid reason. Well, uh, how do you know that? Your dream world self was complaining. Dream world? Who in the world are you? I'm Dormy Sweet, a ruler, I mean ruler of dreams. And this is Hata no Kokoro from the Dream World. This person is full of ugly emotions. I can't believe this is a Celestial. I can't accept the existence of someone with such ugliness. Blasted. Get lost. Wait, what's that ability? What is that ability exactly? I'm trying to test again. Fuck, let me test it, please! I hate you so much right now, Coco. You have no idea. Now, what is that ability? Is that just for like increased movement? Okay, busted that one open. Alright, can we get the damage? Oh, not much. Cause that was a little too long for a combo chain in my opinion. Oh, whoops. Big ass rocks do work. Yes, they do. You say you're from the Drew world. The weaker they are, the louder they bark. It's my first time seeing her. Are you really the ruler of dreams? Of course. So what you said earlier about being exiled from heaven is true. The person in question is right there. Why don't you ask her yourself? Well, it's true I was exiled, but it was a, it was a ridiculous reason. I'm a pure celestial, and I've been important since I was born, so I don't need to work. 
I was bored, so I took a taste of some beef tongue for a festival. It didn't even taste good, but everyone was so upset. They said I was in the way of preparing for the festival, so I was kicking it out to the earth for the time being. Isn't it ridiculous? Uh, yeah, er, uh, it's ridiculous? I don't understand why, I don't understand why it's ridiculous. Actually, I don't really get it. Why the fuck is that beef so important? Is she stalling? Just tell her to get the fuck, or I guess sending her to, her to Earth is getting the fuck out of there. Okay, fair enough. I'm important, you know? I can't believe the gun had on me. Well, uh, I don't understand why you call the delinquent celestial. Huh, look, what's that? Let's become the strongest duo. I finally captured the inching. Now we can rule the world. <laughs> I never thought I would get along with an outsider. What's this? Who are you? Huh? What do you mean? Who are you? Another inchling? Two inchlings. A doppelganger? Oh, shit. the dialogue. Whatever. By accident. I thought we were fighting, but... Okay. You know what? Oh, shit. That's actually pretty cool. That's ten she's grabbed. That's, that's not actually pretty legit. That's fucking badass. That just like, boom, bitch! Like, boom, boom, boom! Yo, someone! Boom! I don't know, that just feels so satisfying to hit. It just feels so good, like, destroy the shit out of her. Oh, shit. And then, oh. Then I think she has a great laser. Okay. Drop him. Oh, that was good damage, though. All right. Now that was fun. That was fun. Sparing that grab was cool. Yes, I won. I'm the real Shimimaru. Huh? Something's wrong. Why are there two Shimimarus? One is a Doppelganger or the Shimimaru from the Dream World. I've been through the same thing, so I understand. Even the real one gets confused. I'm the real one. What is this imposter saying? I'm the real one. I guess it doesn't matter. Let's continue, partner. Aye, aye, sir. Wait, I think I just had that rule. Huh, <laughs> that's not possible, imposter. I actually don't know who's the real Shim uh, Shimimaru, you get it? A Celestial and a Hermit. Are you the rumor Celestial? Yup! Foul before me. This one's a Hermit that lives in the mountains. Maybe she's lonely, but she comes to the shrine a lot. A Hermit? Are you devoting yourself every day? Yes, I do so without being told. Is this the ancient? A little one working with an even smaller one? Even though she's like this, it still seems it seems she's still celestial. Though one day I believe I will take that spot. Come, what do you mean you're devoted? You're, you're devoted every day. Your whole body's flowing with pride. Let me caution you as a celestial: blend with the light and become one with the dust. Huh? A celestial warning doesn't that doesn't resonate at all. I shall return those words right back to you. Abandon the heaven's light and return to the dirt. All right, let's do this. Oh, that feels good. So fucking good. I don't know why. But I actually don't know if I... I think I grabbed, but that wasn't intentional, though. Whatever. Oh, shit. Okay, I didn't even use that now. Oh, I mean, that could just work. Activate spell card. Oh, fuck, wrong button. Whatever.
Why did that turn out so well? Okay, stop that, stop that. Drop them! And one more spell card, I believe. Oh, okay. Let's see how. To oh. Okay, okay. So it's Ray Casey's big ball and then turns into the Pokeball. Okay, this is actually. That's also a fun one. And it summons those guys too, so that's actually a pretty cool combo. I like that. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Just a little more, and then I'm done with this one, I believe. Drop kick to the ground, or not? No, or not. That works too. You can just ignore the whole shit, asshole. Weak, too weak. Don't think you reach your you'll reach heaven with that. Once is less still, always is less still. It's true that I still lack diligence. Hey, hey, it sure went well. This hermit and Baki Tanuki are the most distinguished in Kitsoku. Now it won't be an overestimate, overstatement to say that we're strongest. Hey, you sound different from when we first met. Oh, no way. I'm, I'm sure. I, I sure don't think so. Well, whatever. Of course, you will become the most powerful on Earth. All right, it's time to go back to heaven. I guess I'll rule the Earth. Nice, nice, very nice, Lady Tenshi. You ain't thinking he's on a different level. Oh boy. Yukari, Earth's natural enemy. Have you have you become used to being a slave? Somewhat. The fate of catching the poverty and pestilence deal will come down to your training, but. But. I feel something is missing to make it perfect. Hey, it's the yokai from before. Oh dear, why are you on Earth? I forgot, this one was still left. I need to beat her or I can't rule the Earth. Why do you have to appear at this moment? I don't have any interest, so please go away. The, this one's a yokai famous for never ending foul play. Pay attention. This inchling, it's not the usual little one. Haha, <laughs> you know us. Yup, I'm Shimi Maru from the Dream World. When everyone's confused, I force possession. What did you say? You're not Shimimaru? I am Shimimaru, but Shimimaru from the Dream World. This side seems more fun, so I switched places during the last battle. Aha, uh -huh, so you can do something like that. Well, as long as we're strong, I don't really care. Switch slaves during battle. The same powers as the Pestilence God. I see, now I understand. I can see how the Pestilence God's ability works. Yes, I remember when he, I know you guys were talking about this. Once we got to this part, uh, we know how to defeat the girl. So yes, this is where we really got like uh, piecing the puzzle together to understand uh, the sister's powers. Stop grumbling, let's fight. I'm going to become the ruler of Gitsoko. Rocks, whatever, whatever they are. Is this the same one? Will it say any difference? Yeah, it's pretty much just. I mean, it's spark, it's twirling, and then rainbow. Okay. Oh shit. Okay, so Lana, what the fuck? What the fuck? Come on, for real? Okay, that's fucking cheeky, you cheeky son of a bitch. That is super cheeky. That is fucking bullshit! Fucking bullshit! Yeah, Tenchi is fucking ridiculous. Oh, fuck. 
Seriously? You cheeky son of a bitch! That is so not cool. Well, that is actually not really gonna hit me. But that's still cheeky. I wanna hit you. Wow, that was annoying as hell. Present in body, but absent in spirit. Who are you fighting against? Thanks to two of you, it looks like Joan and Xion will be captured. I have figured out perfect possession. Now slaves are free. Oh shit. Oh shit, I thought it was, was shooting me that time. Oh, okay, it's interesting. So I switch out between the two. Alright, pop this up. And boot him! Gotta love them rocks, rocks. Rock, rock, rocks. Rock, rock, rock. Rock, rock, rock. All right, interesting. Very deep ending. Nothing too crazy in terms of story wise, ter story plot wise, but it was still good. And obviously, with this, we get the Yukari and Reimu route. So you know, we finally beat the sisters. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. But anyway, like always, this is my channel. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Yeah.